previously on Mokenchi Vlogs. And then start filling it up with tree soil. Starbucks to get uh, coffee or something, maybe something to snack on, you know. Yep. That's what the traffic's looking like. Not too busy this morning. No, not too busy. Starbucks gonna be busy though. Yep. Starbucks and Chick Fil A always. I got me my pumpkin spice cake and I love this stuff warmed up. If you go to Starbucks and you like pumpkin spice, you should try it. It's not strong pumpkin spice. I don't like all pumpkin spice, but I love this cake. And a small vanilla latte. Yeah. Hey, beautiful. How are you? Hi. What are you doing scooting down that chair? What are you doing scooting down that chair? Are you posing for the camera? Why you do that? Come on. Ah, yeah. Good girl. Hey guys. Hey guys. Hey peeps. <laughs> Say, what are you doing, Dad? <laughs> hey peeps My name is My name is Giona And I am four months old Four months old What are you guys doing today? What are you doing? <laughs> Do, do, do. Follow me and everything is alright I'll be the one who tuck you in at night I'm saying follow me and I can guarantee You won't find nobody else like me Oh, no, you can't have the tissues. <laughs> you can't have the tissues. 
Thank you. All right, pumpkin. That was my favorite one, too. <laughs> that was my favorite one. All right, Daddy, you want to hold those arms for me? Yeah. All right. Her legs are strong. I know. Usually they are. Oh, I know. Oh, my God. I know, pumpkin. I know. All done. All done. Yes, What is this? Am I not comforting enough for you, Kiona? Am I not comforting enough for you when you get shots? <laughs> That's right. You're not mommy. Well, you and mommy can dress you then, Kiona. I am going to dress her. Excuse me. <laughs> 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 My perfect little baby. <laughs> I like this shirt. Me plus dad equals love. Is that right? Is that right? Mm, is that right? My juicy, juicy fruit. My juicy, juicy fruit. My juicy, juicy fruit. Boo. 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 My gift wrap, baby. There you go, hun. My gift wrap baby. Yep. Thank you, My gift wrap baby. Hey. You broke out of your cocoon. You broke out of your cocoon. She can't reach the ground yet. <laughs> She's officially four months. Mm -hmm. Our daughter's four months old. She likes her toys. Daddy, I can't reverse back my seat. <laughs> She's trying to get out. <laughs> oh, yeah. Generous way out. You want a job? Come to my office. Seriously. This is ridiculous. As the businessman writes down his office telephone number, Jennifer confides she needs to stay. First day, I just can't leave, like right in the middle. You can leave. Yeah, yeah absolutely. absolutely. Yeah, you start bending down. <laughs> <laughs> Shut up. I'll pay for the day to leave right now. Nice guy. But too often, women have to deal with harassment on their own. And very few of them report. Oh. Texans, the lone star state. The second biggest So we're watching, what huh? would you do? Uh -huh. I don't know, I want to get your face when you get really into it. It's too, it's not lit up enough. So what would you do if someone said that, like, said, made a, ra made a racist comment towards us, like, we're not supposed to be together or whatever? Or you witnessed it happening to somebody else? See, I'm more defensive than... A more reflexive defensive I think I think if it was me I would just up and walk away and leave I'd give him the face but if it was somebody else I would say something no when it comes to that you'd be like Hun, don't say nothing don't no, say nothing no. yes you no, would no, 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 yes you do that's no. what you always do no you are the one you are the one 
Every time someone said something racist to us, and two times that we've been together, you told me not to do anything. Right, that's what I said. If it's me, I would just up and walk away. But, like, if it's at a restaurant and happening to somebody else, I would say something. No, no, I would say something. When it comes, I do not tolerate racist crap. I do not. You know that. Right. And if you keep on saying I don't, you're sleeping in the extra room tonight. Uh, no, what I, I said, whenever we come into a situation and it's, I, I'm, I said a situation. I didn't necessarily mean a racist situation. You say, I'm just leave it alone. Don't say nothing. Don't say nothing. And you pull me and you say, don't say nothing. Don't say nothing. <sighs> it depends on how it is, how it plays out and what it is. I don't know. But what I do not tolerate like, racism. But, like, not all of them was racist. Like, the. Wait, we are watching. What about the guy and his girlfriend? Would you have said something? Yes. To his father? Yes, I would have. I would have definitely. <laughs> I would have definitely. That's his high pitch. That's his high pitch. Yeah, right, boys. No, I would have. <laughs> I would have told you to leave the. I would have told you to leave this. To leave. Go to the car or whatever. Because some people will just get really violent when you tell them off. I would tell you and take to take Keona. Yeah, to the car. it would be different with Keona now, but. No, even with you. Because that guy can know that guy could have friends who are at the top table in the dining room as well. Well, he and, could have friends who are outside too. But if you're already in the car ready to go, at least I know you are safe. He can have friends outside. But he won't know. He won't know I'm about to confront him at, at that moment when you're already in car and you can drive off readily at the dime and you can run over someone but try to attack him. <laughs> I'm well, people yeah. see who you associate it with. I'm just saying. I want to make sure. Or you're at the front desk. You're away from where I am. So you wouldn't get caught in the crossfire. If he got angry or whatever and you went after me, I will make sure you're not in the crossfire of it. So, yes. Yeah. Yes. What about the sexual harassment one? Yes, I don't stand for that either. Cause I can't send a thought of you being sexual harassed at work if you if something like that did happen to you. Yeah, that's right. Cause you were about to come into the restaurant with the gift certificate the other day. <laughs> You're with Kiona and Toe. Yeah, I just started tossing all my stuff underneath the the little <laughs> dashboard. With Keona in my arms, getting ready to go in there and see what's wrong, because you went in there to buy a gift certificate for my parents. And you were taking like 45 minutes just to buy a like, certificate. There was no shop in there. So I was starting to worry. And people out here are opportunists, and they take advantage, and they prey on women. So, yes. So, uh, anyways, I'm going to get back to watching more of this. <laughs> okay. Well, it's the end of the night, and we were up watching, oh, we were up watching What Would You Do on YouTube, and it's just, what would you do? Would you stand up to bullies and racist people or child kidnappers or, or burglars, one most wanted people, or would you just let them... Uh, go free just doing what they're doing what would you do leave it in the comment box below what would you do in whatever situation what would you do what what kind of situation would have to happen to get you to react like I ain't chasing down no wanted criminal but if you're making fun of someone with autism or saying that they're rude or if if you're harassing somebody um, because of their race or something or the interracial couple or something I might say something well and then and then it's different now like I can't just go all loose cannon on somebody because I have Kiona with me 
like but it, then I would call the cops mm -hmm. yeah that sounds like a plan I just have to stifle my stifle my reflexes yep my reflexes but the thing is if it's for myself a lot of time and I'm, I've always been this way if it's me being harassed I would either bear it or walk away just leave and not even say something but if it was my friends or somebody I would always defend them and I don't know I don't know that's just how I've always been I'm more of a defensive person than I don't know not no I like not not trying to be a hero I'm not a hero I'm a spur I'm a chicken like I ain't trying to die for stupid reasons but if you're being a bully then you need to be put in place it's just I'm not gonna sit by and watch you be a bully to some person um, cuz I mean I've been there I've been beat down physically mentally and it's not nice and I can't have I can't sit by and watch it happen to somebody else because it's like I know how it feels um right so what I was saying was like what about like with Kiona I have to have to be reserved and not do something but like in my conscience is like I should do something but I can't do something so, and I'm playing my face because usually I play my lips like this, like a cartoon character. And Cam calls me duck lips. Well, anyway, thanks for watching, guys. Don't forget to give us a thumbs up. Thumbs up. And, and, um, subscribe don't forget, don't forget me. comment you didn't even you see you didn't even you saying don't forget you you don't even want to pick up the camera though I do pick up the camera no you don't after yeah, I neg you to you don't even you didn't even want to pick up the camera or anything and then you always ask where's you the good footage it's right here it's right here. Down here is sexy. Right, like that's gonna make the video. Huh? Like that's gonna make the video. Your booty's hot. Oh my goodness. <laughs> so, uh, anyway. It's called spooning. Good night, everybody. Spooning. We'll see you tomorrow. Oreo style. <laughs> Give us a thumbs up. Thumbs, thumbs up. up. A comma, uh, uh, subscribe. So you don't miss out on to our more tribe. Kiona, but she's sleeping right Sus now. So subscribe to our tribe, yo. Yes, we don't have a tribe. It's just the three of us. You know, this my beard makes it look like I have a butt crack. Butt uh, chin. Yeah, when out of tribe, it's just the three of us. Hey, that's a tribe. No, it's not. T in begins at uh, tribe begins with T. Three begins with T. Oh so boy. both T's they relate to each other. So you tribe. The H. Mm. Anyway, a tribe equals a basketball team. We didn't have all that. Yep, so guys, I'm gonna go run tomorrow morning. <laughs> I don't know about running, but I'm saying good night, and you coming in talking your garbage. Good night, guys. <laughs>